Hi, Chicken Betty. We're back with your dear dog. So we're still working. You might want to move forward a little bit so you're not getting squeaky there in the background. subtask of I don't want the leash made tight. She's going to be less prone to do it here because we worked with her more here and we are going to you know, go out again next week for a couple more field trips. But we're just shaping the behavior of heel. I'm not going to come back in two days and say, oh, I've already got the dog healing. You know, and that's why, you know, it takes time. It's a step-by-step -step process. Because she had the habit before of pulling, we need to undo that before we can heal. So, what I can do though, because she's definitely smarter than the average dog, is I can start using the treats, and I definitely want you guys to get a treat thing like this, because we've, we've made the association with the pager and the treats, and we want to continue that. The pager is something that is very positive. All right, we got the little side Dallas show going on over here. So... I'm still working. I'm not going to use the command heel. I'm just going to shape, but I can start using my treats to start making walking beside me more appealing. dog, it turns that way better. There we go. Thank you. 